Greetings viewers, Car Doctor here, coming to you today with a quick case study on unwanted ABS activation. This case study vehicle is a 04 Buick Rendezvous. Customer was complaining of unwanted ABS activation or the ABS pump motor on the left front of the vehicle making uh, noise during certain braking maneuvers, but only doing it a couple times a day. It was a tough one to nail down in that uh, the vehicle didn't exhibit any ABS codes, which would indicate a faulty speed sensor. Uh, and uh, for the most part, had a clear signal coming from all four uh, wheel speed sensors. Uh, so it was a little bit tricky. One of the first things I did was raise the vehicle and check the uh, wheels and check uh, for any play in the bearings. Everything felt tight. I did notice that the left front hub assembly uh, appeared to have been replaced in the last year or so and it had a little blue collar on the inside of the hub flange uh, which was different than the rest but no play in any of the hubs. Uh, but on my first test drive I did get some unwanted ABS activation during a slight turn and braking maneuver. Uh, it was brief and uh, it actually did it twice on that road test and uh, by the time I got back to the shop it had cleared up. I connected my scan tool uh, and uh, brought up all four wheel speed sensor patterns and drove it again and monitored those, but I couldn't get it to uh, duplicate the issue. And uh, I drove it all over the place. I put it back on the rack. I shook things down again. I took it back out and drove around. And, uh, and then I let it cool off for like an hour or two. And then I took it back out and luckily as I uh, pulled it out of the shop, I got some unwanted ABS activation and a clear signal dropout on the left front wheel speed sensor, uh, which is indicated in the screenshot I took. Uh, so uh, I guess the moral of the story is uh, sometimes if you have this intermittent ABS activation and it's, it's uh, it's a very intermittent. Um, you're probably not going to figure it out unless you have the ability to record this data over a period of time, catch it in the act, and then review it. In this case, uh, it, a little over a year ago, the left front hub assembly was replaced at the dealer uh, with a quality part. However, there's some type of defect in there. And uh, anyway, it's a, the sensor is part of the hub assembly itself, and uh, it's going to require a complete hub assembly replacement. I'm using the national hub assembly, uh, which is a quality replacement part, and I have 100% uh, confidence that that's going to get this thing wrapped up and back on the road. So anyway, just a little bit of case study work. Hope this helps, and uh, hope you enjoy it. And uh, I hope you have a great day and good luck with your repairs. This has been the car doctor. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.